guys, welcome to another vlog. As you can see, we are in a swimsuit. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> well, I'm in a tank top, but yeah, Scarlett's in a swimsuit. Where, where are we at? This is Lake, Lake Paris, is it? So I've always called it Lake Paris, but the official name is the Paris Reservoir. Yeah, let's go in Moreno Valley, California. Paris. Huh? Is it Paris, California? Oh, okay. So, yeah. Alright, we're gonna eat some pupusas as well. Yeah. <laughs> Cousin in the background. <laughs> if you grab going the water, there's no cell service here, so we won't be playing some Pokemon here, obviously. Nope. But we're gonna get in the water. I'm gonna use my GoPro camera underwater. I haven't done that in a long time, so I'm hoping it doesn't bust. But either way, the phone stays in the bag and the GoPro camera comes out. So let's go get it. Let's get in the water and let's see how that water is. It's probably cold. But we're in the desert, so it wouldn't make a difference. Yeah, yeah, that's sexy. Yeah. Let's go. Yeah. <laughs> it's getting colder. That's for It is cold. <laughs> what do you think? It's cold. It's getting colder though. The more we go in. Yeah, I. It is cold. Sorry, you're not doing your job. It's cold. <laughs> Ooh, and I can't see nothing inside. It's summer yet, sir. Yeah, I, I know it's not summer, but... <laughs> oh, it's that free. It was cool. Okay, I think I'm done. <laughs> it's too cold. It's too cold. I need to, like, be brave and take it in. Ooh. <laughs> you easily get in there. Oh, I'm tippy-toeing, though. I'm tippy-toeing. Oh, ooh, my lower half is freezing right now. <laughs> I can't feel my. Oh. Okay, I think this is good. This is good. <laughs> <laughs> no! <laughs> no! <laughs> <laughs> wow, you would think I'm from New York. I'm used to the cold. I don't like the cold. Actually, oh, he actually just dumped in deep. Oh shit! And there goes Scarlet. <sighs> Guess it's my turn. <laughs> no, I'm free holding right now. <laughs> One, two, three. <laughs> you the Godzilla? Not <laughs> <laughs> that. It's cold. Let's go. It's cold. My knees are wet. I tell you, I'm weak. <laughs> Yo, it's time. It's pupusa time. We got some pupusa to eat now. <laughs> They're empanadas salvadoreñas. Time. Uh, These are pupusas salvadoreñas that are that are it's Supposed to have more stuff on it, but you know that's good. Oh, so good. Mm. I think I'm gonna eat this. Lay down. I'm done for this day. Nap time. Yeah, definitely. Mm.
cold. <laughs> you stay under water like this, you don't feel as much, but it is cold. You just go and the, the water is kind of like not clear, so you can't really see much. Not really see much. I wouldn't expect to see anything under water anyway, but you know. NPR, if I could find the block somewhere, I'll put it up here somewhere. NPR, I was on the beach, Cañagorla, and you could actually see the fish swimming underneath you if you're lucky. They were like blend in with the water, but you could see it. Yeah, I even saw a barracuda one time. That's barracuda. not part of that was not in the block, but yeah, I did see a barracuda. Yeah, here you're not gonna see nothing. <laughs> it's kind of dark, <laughs> but it's a lake. It's not a beach, so you know, every in California, so there ain't no gators here, as far as I know. Yeah, I don't think there's any gators out here. But yeah, it'd be cool to see some wildlife. Ah, there were some squirrels. <laughs> kind of different from what I'm used to in New York. And even here, here in California, the squirrels are different. They're brown. Yeah. But here, they like, really have no... Pescado. Pa pescado. There's <laughs> fish and pesera. La mitad va por llevar. Ah, pa pesera. ¿Tú tienes la pesera? Yeah. Sí. Oh, shit, I want one. Penny, Penny, that's tocando una mano así. Quería comer. Yeah. Wow, I want one. I want a fish tank. All right, pase. I'm saying I'm gonna like to have a fish tank. I used to have a thing when I was young. I would go fish in a lake. I would always go fishing. I don't care if I had a fishing rod. I had just I didn't need, just needed a line, a fishing line, a fishing line, some hooks, bait, and a bucket. That's it. But I got caught. I took home with me. That was my thing. I had I had caught some sunnies. I have caught some catfish. I've caught. I even caught a snapping turtle one time. I took everything home. Everything home. And my and my mom is watching. And my sister. <laughs> they could they could say that it's facts. <laughs> I always brought it home. So I may pick the, I may pick that hobby back up again. I just need a tank, fish tank first. At some point in our room. But yeah, it's cool. I love fishing when I was young. I haven't done it. I've been out of it. In New York, there ain't no lake, so I mean there was, but I didn't really done didn't, didn't, didn't any fishing because I didn't have a car. I normally used to go upstate, drive upstate to the the lakes upstate, Seven Lakes, Vermont, and etc. etc. That's the places where I would go fishing at um, Hudson Park and on 80th Street and um, Bergen Line Avenue, and yeah, up in Jersey. I used to go fishing there as well, but yeah, it's been, I've been, I was out of touch, so I haven't done it. I got used to not doing it more doing this now than fishing, <laughs> but I'm hoping to pick it up at some, some point. You know, let's go, it's water's feeling nice. But like I was saying, the squirrels here are brown. And ones in New York are gray and sometimes black. Um, you see black and gray. Yeah. Why is the water warm right here? Why are you peeing in the water? <laughs> I get in the way. <laughs> get in the way from Scarlet. You know what? Let me go back. It's cold over here. <laughs> yeah. So there's some squirrels here. When we, like, when we first got in, they're like... Burrow under the sand and the tails have ever seen. I never seen that one before. I would like to research what type of species it is. I love watching wildlife. It's one of my things. Wildlife, fishing, all that stuff, sea life. Yeah, scarlet. <laughs> I may be wild, but I'm not wildlife. <laughs> You're wild. You're part of it. Yeah, that's good. I didn't say that. that they have here there's a whole bunch of them but they're different they make burrows on the ground and in the sand they're like everywhere they are everywhere yeah it has a picnic area this has a picnic area as well awesome and it has barbecue so you can actually make anything that's really cool it's cool that was, I said earlier about the last time I went to the beach in PR was a place called Caña Gorda. Um, yeah, I mean, I went to Orlando, obviously, to to Volcano Bay, and it's not the same. It's, you know, last time I went to a place like, like some, similar like this was a beach, was in, was in Puerto Rico, it was Caña Gorda. I did do a blog. It was August of 2020. I did do a blog, but I never edited it. So maybe this time right here in this video I will put it together with that. Look in, look into my archive, see if I can find the footage for that for that day. It was a day I spent with my mom, 
my stepfather. We drove around the countryside. It was during the peak pandemic, so yeah. So it was a little bit different, but the beach was empty. It's pretty cool. I did do a TikTok on it. At that time, I had Mia. I mean, I had Mia, but Mia was still not with me. Oh, well, she was with me. She was left at the house. But that was the time when I went to pick me up. I had I was doing more TikTok with my Charmeleon. So the TikTok is basically my Charmeleon plushie. <laughs> I just never got a chance to edit the blog. So I'll leave this time now for now. I'll, leave the, I'll probably end this part of the blog here. You can hope you guys enjoy that. The next the next section going back in time to 2020. A day in Kenya, go with my family. Up in Aguanica, Puerto Rico. Yeah, let's go. Let's go back in time, guys. Alright guys, welcome to the vlog. This is Will Rock again coming at you from Guanica, Puerto Rico. We are currently in Caña Gorda. This is a beach. I have a few blocks before. I put it up here somewhere. I do have a, a block here for 4th of July. Some time ago, a few years back. Just before I came to New went back to New York. So yeah, the beaches are open. They, they reopened the beaches, so we came here today. There's nobody here people here and there came early but um yeah um gonna try and enjoy the last week or so of my uh <laughs> trip i was supposed to leave tomorrow i was supposed to be today's the 13th i was supposed to be leave tomorrow september 14th and um cancel my flight i just cancel it so i'm gonna rebook it i have an appointment on the 16th which is two days but now they're saying that um somebody got DMV so that may be closed so uh, I don't know what's gonna happen I think everything appointments everything's been closed if that's the case then I'm, I'm gonna see rest in peace to my um, license because I came here for that reason I spent a lot of money already getting stamps and other stuff and getting birth certificate and all the paperwork and now I don't even know if I won't get my license or not but I'll find out in two days what's gonna happen and now I'm gonna have to leave after that I plan I was planning to save the 28 but if I can't get my license I'll probably leave it earlier than that I just need to get the paperwork from my dog, which I would, I already have everything. She has shots and everything, so I just need to get the papers for that and get a COVID test to go back. That's pretty much it. Enjoy the beach here today. I'm using the Sony camera just to do some B-roll and do this. Intro. I am going to switch to the GoPro from the water. So that's pretty much it, guys. We just enjoy here. Just here. I'm here with my mom, my stepdad. I have no cell service, no whatsoever. I'm here, which is kind of weird. There was so service but now there isn't so can't communicate anybody can't post anything until after we come back out of here back on the freeway. So that's it pretty much it. Let's enjoy the water, get in the water, get in the beach, join the sights, enjoy the food and pretty much it. Let's go.
service. I have no cell service. Yeah, Pokemon plane will be zero. I used to have cell service here. I had, there's no Poke stops here. That was just a, that was, that was a Ankler. I was I, I was thinking about doing a nomination if it wasn't a Poke stop, but I can't open the game, so can't do it. There's no really no Poke stops around here, but as far as I know from back then, but there was spawns a lot of. I already see water type spawns around here, but since I can't open the game, I cannot check. And there's nobody in the reach, so I'm just walking around. Um, I should put a note. This is Guanica. I know I said it before. This is Guanica. This is the epicenter. Of most of the per um, sorry, of all most of the sorry, I'm just looking something at the floor. Uh, most of all the earthquakes that has happened here in Puerto Rico this is the place Juanica. this is the area where most of them are the big ones was here let's see take a rest see if we can find a reef this reef not far from here a lot of fishes I like to film on the water stuff I just don't have any goggles or anything like that so yeah this is the epicenter where all the earthquakes have been happening um, a lot of the a lot of the water properties how homes they are not, they were like this beach property have now been either underwater or the water has come come up so whenever there's a hurricane whenever there's tropical storm or even just regular rainfall now the water comes up to their homes and stuff so I don't know how they're doing that but yeah I mean there's always been damages to the school that was crushed literally crushed if I could find an image out somewhere because I haven't had a chance to see it this is the place where it happened there's also a few businesses which I seen on the highway. I said we turn over here, but it's hard to film as we're driving. So, so a lot of businesses also. There was like a, a like a building, like a few businesses that also got crushed. That's also here. So yeah, it's like my mom's kind of uh, afraid about coming here because of that because she's just you know not paranoid, but it's understandable of all the earthquakes that's been happening here. There's just not, not my family has been like really. Um, Nervous about it and I'm top about it because it's, it's just literally constantly, constantly. They're trying to find a reef. There used to be a reef on here somewhere, but since the other earthquake things, things have changed a lot, the water rises and I can't see on the water right now. So I don't have my goggles. I had a ring, wasn't planning to come to the beach, and I don't have one. I used to have one to live out here in New York. I don't go to the beach, so I think I left it out here when I moved. You see, there's nobody here. Look, nobody in the water. My stepfather, that's him right there. Ain't nobody here. So at least with the COVID situation, we don't have to worry about it. there's nobody around to get close to. So, but when it's like this, a lot of the wildlife tend to come, come past the line. So that's what we gotta be careful of because you've seen a lot of video footage of stingrays and sharks just coming through, too close with the water. So you know where people are supposed to be bathing but people you know usually wildlife tends to stay away from that but less people wildlife starts to come back so that's what I'm afraid of <laughs> I don't want to step on something I'm not supposed to a stingray or, or sea urchin or something out of the ordinary and then I get stung or some jellyfish so yeah this guy's over there snorkeling check it out he's, he's way past the line oh they closed the beach that's why they closed to make the beach closer over here Ah, because they used to, uh, that's why I'm looking at the reef over here and the reef is over there. So, yeah. Okay, so I can't get over there. Oh, because look at the damage. That's all damage from the earthquake right there. Those, that's why it's closed up. Those things had been closed because of the earthquakes. I did not notice that until now. Woo! Well, let's go. Let's see if we can find the reef and now we just enjoy the water. Enjoy the water. Sorry, I'm without a shirt, guys, but it's just I'm in the water and. <laughs> I didn't bring any extra shirts. So let's just enjoy the water. Let's go.
So there's been a few people coming in. A few people in the field. Left the bike. But um, it's not bad. They're pretty empty. Uh. <sighs> Damn it. I finally got a little bit of self service. Just been taking pictures and whatever and <laughs> posting it up in my social media. So make sure you leave a check if you want. Like, like to check out some pictures of the family, whatever. Just me and my mom. Step that in. Just. Just me, pictures goofing off in the sun, and beaches, whatever. Make sure you follow me on on Instagram. Follow me on Facebook. Uh, I probably post them also on Discord and and on um, Twitter. So yeah, you make sure you follow those. All the links to that are in the description below. I am trying to grow the community in Discord, guys. So if you're if you're into Pokemon Go, Call of Duty, or anything in general. Like, I, I, I probably do a, a one for movies as well because I, I, I am a movie buff, so I like to watch movies. So I probably switch things around. I probably do servers for that. Great GTA as well. When the PS5 comes out, and I get it, I'll definitely make a, a thing for the PS5 for that. So yeah, just make sure you follow the channel in Discord. Trying to get the community. Trying to grow the community. And pretty much it, guys. I'm here chilling to do just chill enjoy the water enjoy the what enjoy the weather it's still nice it's not not that hot because the sun is above me but the water is not that cold it's all right because the sun is up there no. right, guys, i think i'll probably end that probably another vlog here guys appreciate you love make sure you subscribe share i may film on my way back home if i haven't already because i am just, just filming things here and there so I have a lot of footage, I just don't know what to do with it, so uh, just making a few little family vlogs here and there when I had a chance. Pokemon again, I did get some service, I have not opened the game yet, I may check it, if I do check it, you may see a like, clip at the end of this and now, it's a nice vlog guys, peace out, I don't know when I'll be back in New York, but I really don't want to go back, <laughs> I love the life here, alright guys, until next time, peace. A few moments later. <laughs> Sorry, I know I said my goodbyes, but um, got the game open, and as you can see, this wild shiny Kyogre. Now that's just my buddy. I I nominated uh, uh, an Ankler. He's probably gonna be here like over there as a Pokestop. I might as well just claim these things right here because why not? Uh, oh my God! Look at all these rewards. Might as well claim this reward. Maybe it could be a shiny. Let's see if it's a shiny and this and this block with a shiny. It'll be cool. Shiny right shoe. And it's not shiny. Ah. Either way, I have not claimed this since GoFest. The Mega Discovery, which is uh, the candies for the. Oh no, this is the Mega Discovery. Oh no, right here. I had this mega discovery to do here too, so I'm gonna claim these. Oh my god, I have not forgotten about this. Completely forgot about this. Maybe it's shiny. Maybe, 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 maybe. No, no. Uh, wow. Power of five times. Evolve Weedle. Okay. If it three. Good ones. Either way, I'm just gonna do this right here. Claim this and be holding it for since school fest. Claim this and take a snapshot of my tiny. I think I'm gonna do that. Do it over here. So here it is. Got my big tiny here. Let me just take a quick AR shot right here. Get this. I'll probably do it right here. Maybe it'll come up. He's by the beach. He's chilling. Let's go. Yeah, shot. I completely forgot about this. I this was part of the blog of day two of my go fest, but I never finished that blog because I was driving that day. And I just didn't really start recording. I never finished it. So let's just claim this. Claim this, and let's see what we get. Here we get the Vitini T. I get two raid passes and two. Piece. Okay, research complete. I think the cell service is going back again. It's been on and off the cell service here. 
I had it. I didn't had it for quite a while, and I just came out. Just got it. Yeah, this thing froze. Ah, it's just froze. So we got a few focus stops. I'm um, far behind the gym, as you can see over here. These are all new focus stop hello stops. I've been here before. I don't think these were here. Maybe one or two, but not. And that gym I'm far behind. This right here. This is uh, another place where you where you went out. Uh, it's like Illa Gilligan. There is um, let's call Illa Gilligan, which is the beach, that island over there, far back there. That's Illa Gilligan. Um, what they do is you get a ferry here at this boat station, and the ferry will take you over there. And you know, throughout the day, you get boats here and there coming back, back and forth. But once you go over there, you have to make sure you go over there. You get plenty of food water everything because over there there's really nothing for you to buy anything to eat the boat just drops you up there and will pick you up if you're not back by the last ferry which is like five o'clock or four o'clock if you don't take it back you spend the night there until they start again the next day and if they're not running the next day you're stuck there you have to swim back eventually because it's like a little further up it's about a 10 about a 10 minute 10 minute um ferry ride not long not far but it is it's beautiful yeah, I went there once, once, but I have not been here since I got here, and I don't think it's open right now because of the earthquakes. I think that area was damaged. So usually it's like it's like it's like an island. Yes, it's an island, but it's like a beach as well. It has small beaches, and there's like chains of islands, and the water goes through each island, so you can actually walk through there, through like in, inside the water. You gotta walk into the water around the island. It has corals and everything. It's beautiful. It's really beautiful, but. Um, I don't think it's open, so I don't think I'll be able to go on this trip. Maybe a future trip, if possible. That's pretty much it, guys. I finally did my research um, for the Go Fest day two. Oh my god! I came to PR for this to kind of be to sightsee for vacation. I really have not been doing that. I've been, I've been back and forth where I used to live at. I've been dog sitting. I've been babysitting my stepdaughter. I've been helping with school work I mean being I've been a parent so that was just, I'm not I don't regret it at all um, I've been painting the house painting rooms help um, clean my mom's backyard yeah, I've started that so I have not been really out really focusing you know plus here in COVID the situation was bad so they have rules and regulations a little more strict than um, than in New York and you know in New York, I'm a, I was an essential worker, so I was out there doing Ubers, whatever. But here, Uber doesn't exist, so I really can't be out and about like I was out there without having an excuse. So, like the last block I had out, I was out walking, and like a cop is telling me, "Oh, I can't be outside unless you do exercise," because it's only with a camera and the phone. I didn't thought I was doing exercise, and I was, because I was walking. I was walking long for a long period of time, so I was doing exercise. So. Uh, I probably end up like here guys. Make sure again guys make sure you leave, leave your support. See if you like, make sure you subscribe. I appreciate you guys following me. Um, I'm gonna keep trying to do this, trying to get motivation, so keep doing this do the best I can. And that's pretty much it guys. Again, links on my uh, on my social medias are below. Follow me on TikTok. I do have Charman Charmeli here with me. He's in the bag. I do took pictures of him. I did took some videos. He's on TikTok. I did not put him on the blog for some reason. I just forgot to film <laughs> as I was filming the TikTok. I forgot to film him, but I'm probably gonna just put him up to you somewhere. You probably probably see him already. So if you saw him, a little cell phone clips that was from the TikTok I made. So if you wanna follow me on TikTok, the link for that is again in the description. Until next time, guys. Next vlog. I got a lot of footage. I don't know what I'm gonna do with it, but again, I'm gonna just mess with it. Upload stuff, maybe a win to get to New York to see what figure things out. Um, because I have been taking films um, of location, location of great damages. So I don't know if I may, may do something like that. I don't know. I'm not sure. I really don't know. I don't know. But I feel something. Good night, guys. Peace out. And I'll see you in the next vlog. Adios.